We're back. I haven't changed much. Just started again. This is part four, I believe. Yes, the last one was mostly cutscene. I'm sorry. Part of the sword needs to forge a sacred sword. Oh wait, part of the sword needs to forge a sacred sword. Don't lose it. You got the smith sword. It's a sharp blade made by your grandfather. Very well then. Send the soldiers to Archibaldi at once. That will help a lot because deep within the Minish woods, you will find a place called Deepwood Shrine. Once humans and Picoris share that shrine as a meeting place, I think it would be great. Best if you start a search there. You search there. Take this map with you. If you get lost on your way to the forest, simply check your map. Just press start and then L or R to open the map. I'll mark the location of the forest for you. Good luck and be careful. You got a map of Hyrule! Now you'll never get lost. Well, not true. That's your map. That's currently the map itself. Everything will be filled out eventually through the plot of the story. So, good luck with that. I'm counting on you, Link. Now the heart appears. Well, you can break Batty's body's curse on free Princess Zelda. I'm off. Yes, you can swipe with the t the same button that equipped to the sword. Repeat, repeat, or press it repeatedly. Stupid. You'll swipe a thousand times as you can hear by that. Anyway, you will get sword and skills later. For now, though, you just have basic skills. So let's get out of here. Yeah, I think something will happen once you get to the center over here. Oh, no, it's not. Never mind. That's later. My bad for spoilers. Anyway. Yes, now, as you can see, there's Octoroks and everything there, and what the hell? The name's Moto. I'm head of carpenter around these parts. The King of Hyrule himself has entrusted me with this project. See, the sorcerer attack tore things up pretty bad around here. You know, kid, you shouldn't be playing anywhere near the construction zone. True enough. Take note of that through life. In any case, we have to get around somewhere. Now that we have a sword, we can do this! The trees are killed! Those are mole bandits. Just keep swiping out the sword, and you should be okay. I am not a noob at this, I've played this a bunch of times. I know strategies for the bosses. The knights are like, wow, a rock. The knight, ow! Sneak attacking bastard. The knights themselves are looking for body. Your job is to get over to Mish Woods. So, instead of taking the direct route, well, you have to take this route. Aw, oh, no item. Whoa. Whoa. Die. Die. Those holes will be eff out effective later. If you're running low on rubies or something, like the usual Zelda games, you can cut the grass. They'll explain all that, the backstory of that later. Die. You can't hold your sword yet. Oh wait, oops. Spoiler, my bad. Right now, all you can do is just swing the sword and hold the shield. So really, you can just... You can also walk into enemies with this. So it's really a bright idea just to defend, attack. Because sometimes when you defend their attacks, they're mobile. And I have a quarter of the heart missing. Wow. Eh, he fell off. No, <laughs> good enough. I'm not Nintendo Capri Sun. Yes, here's my shout out to one of the greatest LPs ever. Die, choo choo. Yes, the red things I've been walking around are Octoroks. The green things are choo choos. 
You do not get their jelly in this game. They're just ordinary slime things. Die. There we go. Let's continue. Oh, what? Oh, didn't see you there because of the freaking camouflage. They're camouflaging themselves. You know, over here, like, what do I do? You hop on the stump, nothing happens though. You up here. You know, when they drop at you, just swing. They'll knock back and swing again, and you'll get another hit on them. And here we go. Help! Help me! What, what, what? Ouch! Won't somebody stop them? Ow, ow! Help! Somebody! Can't anybody hear me? Amazing how we were just there and he... Or it disappeared. Yeah, you may hear another knock. I apologize for that the last time. Forgot to tell my father about that. Told my mother, but not my father. Anyway. Here we go! More plot! Hey kid, you there! Ow! Hey, don't just stand there. Do something. Ow! What's wrong with you? Don't like you like watching me take this abuse. Help me! Now just kill the Octorox. Not that hard. Just swing, swing, and there we go. Phew! Well done. That was close. Now I can handle it myself. Well, that's besides the point. What in the world is a lone child doing in the deep woods? Oh ho, I see. You may be noticing how Link doesn't have a hat right now. Well, you're about to find out why. The Bikori, you say? And Vati? Vati's here as someone? What? The Sacred Blade? Is that so? I see, I see. You know, you and I have quite a lot in common. You see, I too am on a quest to break a curse of Vati's. And you say that our forging the sacred blade can break his curse, eh? Well, then you found yourself a companion, my boy. My name is Ezlo. It's a pleasure to make your acquaintance. So now he'll follow us. You can also talk to him. What? Is there something on my face? Quit staring. It's rude. Wait, wait, I say. He'll always do that, so just deal with it. You walk so quickly. Too quickly, in fact. I'll stay with you the whole journey, so we'll have to deal with this crap the whole entire time. Can you go any slower? Surely you know that I have no legs. He stays in there and I just walk away. Wow. Boy, take a look at me. Do I really think? Do you really think I can walk that fast? I believe one more time. Ah! If it isn't one thing, it's another. You are a troublesome boy. Yeah, you couldn't see him there, but now he's on our head. Sorry, Fog can't help it. There! Now he can't possibly leave me behind. Yes, now we have a hat that talks. My, you're quite comfortable up here. More comfortable than it looks, surely. Much easier on me. Hey, quit your squirming. Can't you sit still? See. There. Yes, yes, that's it. Much better. Now I suppose a boy like you still has much to learn about the world. If you ever need my insights, press select. I'll be happy to help. Yes, press select and he'll talk to you. You can keep doing it and he'll say interesting things. Every time you re enter the game, you'll all I'll explain that later when I start recording again tomorrow. Ah, oh, such a helpless child. Helpless child. Oh, screw you. I'll roll to piss you off. <laughs> yes, now Link has a hat. Hooray. And more plot. Hold on for a moment, my boy. We've stumbled upon something important. The world of the Minish is very small. You're far too big to meet him now. Eh? Do I the Minish? Ah, yes. Silly me. Now, I'm going to explain. You humans call them Picori, but they refer to, be to themselves as the Minish. Strange how in the world humans only the, this forest was kept has kept that name. But anyhow, deep in the forest, they built a tiny village. There are many now live. 
But if we were to enter the village, we'll make such a small effort. Yep. It's about 10 minutes. I'm going to stop right about now. <laughs>